I'm making Grimace the birthday cake he deserves. Now, I'm sure you all heard of the Grimace birthday shake, and for some odd reason, I wanted to make Grimace a birthday cake. Probably because it's purple and it's my favorite color. So we're gonna be making Grimace a mini funfetti birthday cake. Dry ingredients first, baby. We got one and two thirds cup of flour, one cup of sugar, Ooh. one fourth teaspoon of baking soda, a teaspoon of baking powder, and a pinch of salt. Give that a little mix. For the wet ingredients, 3 fourths cup of unsalted room temperature butter. I hate this thing. What am I doing wrong? <laughs> ah, success. Just give that a nice little stir. Now three egg whites at room temperature. There we go. Oh, shit. I dropped it in. No. Daddy. I dropped the yolk in. Get it out. Oh, no. It's already incorporated. <laughs> oh, well. So much for that. And that is why you do it over a separate bowl. No, God! We're just gonna roll with it. Three teaspoons of almond extract and half a cup of milk. I'm just gonna give it a little scrapey scrape so it's all incorporated. Or incorporative? <laughs> now let's mix these two together to make a delicious cake, baby. Now for the fun fetty, we're just gonna hold in some sprinkles into the batter. I don't know how much to add, but it's just up to you how much fun you wanna add. I want more fun. Leo says more fun. More fun. That looks awesome. I don't know why sprinkles just make me so happy. They're just so colorful. I've already put butter on this, so just wanna make sure that it doesn't stick to the sides. I'm also lining the bottom with this parchment paper that I cut out into circles. Now we just pour in our batter. I'm gonna bake them for 20 to 25 minutes at 340 degrees Fahrenheit, but I'm gonna continue to check on them because the recipe I'm following has a larger cake, so see how this goes. While the cake is cooling, we're gonna make the buttercream. I'm gonna mix together half a cup of butter and half a cup of shortening until it's smooth and fluffy. Next, I'm gonna add one teaspoon of almond extract and three tablespoons of heavy whipping cream. Next, add in three cups of powdered sugar, one cup at a time, making sure that it is completely incorporated. Once you've added your sugar, beat for an additional four to five minutes. Now that the icing is nice and fluffy, it's time to decorate. So obviously the cake is going to be purple, but we're also gonna incorporate some whites in there. So I'm gonna set aside some of my frosting in this piping bag with a tip already on it for decorating. And then I'm gonna dye the frosting to be a light lavender color. So I'll be using this color to frost the cake and for design, so I'm just putting it in this Wilton 103 tip. So now just to cut off the tops of the cake and prepare it to be stacked. A Little bit of icing on the bottom. To keep that in place. A little on the bottom for the cake. Now time for the layers. Crumb layer is now complete. I'm gonna cool it for a little. After the crumb layer has dried, I put on some more buttercream and tried to get it as smooth as possible. And 
now we get to go in with the tips and decorate. I'm just going to, you know, go with the flow. What would Grimace do? I think I'm gonna do, I think I'm gonna just start with the white on the bottom here. It's kind of hide the edge. I just want it to be nice and fluffy. I'm not even sure if I'm using these tips correctly. I have never used this one before. Oh, I think you're supposed to kind of spike it out like that. Okay, I get it, we're learning. So for the style here, we're going with the vintage cake because I believe Grimace is in his 50s. 50s is now vintage. We'll just go with this one again around the edges because I like how fluffy it looks. Maybe I should do like a drooping design. I'm gonna try, let's go for it. I kinda like it, okay, I think I can make this work. This is so fun. <laughs> I love doing this. birthday cake. I love it. This was so much fun to do. I have never decorated a cake like this and I can probably refine my technique, but I still think this came out so cute. It's my favorite purple birthday cake ever. I think all that's left to do now is sing Grimace happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy 